In these problems, we're looking at two-step equations, and again, you can solve them intuitively. Nothing wrong with that. We're just trying to develop your skill with balancing equations. So here, intuitively, let's go over that first. You have 10x plus 5 equals 3. So something, right? 10x is something. It's some number. And when you add 5 to it, you get 3. Well, well what could do that? You might realize it has to be a negative number, right? So most of my students realize that and say, oh, well, then I'll take 3 minus 5. I'll work backwards. It's negative 2. And now I know that 10x has to equal negative 2. And then, then what? Well, what times 10 equals negative 2? And we get a fraction here. And that's negative 1 fifth, right? And that's what x equals 2. So here, that intuition might be a little bit tricky for you. Um, but that's I want to confirm that that makes a lot of sense. But I want to show you that that intuition can be clearly written out and thought about through balancing equations. Now, 10x plus 5 equals 3, right? Well, here, usually the first step is to add or subtract something before you divide. So here, we'll subtract 5 from both sides. And usually, what you can do is add or subtract some number uh, from the side with the x value on it, because you want to get rid of those numbers and isolate x. So here, this becomes 0. That's negative 2. And negative 2 equals 10x. Here, we divide both sides by 10. By 10 times something is negative 2. So now we undo that. And x equals negative 2 over 10, or negative 1 fifth. Be sure to reduce each fraction when you can. And that's it. Thanks.